एवरीवन आई एम निधि एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल पूरा अक्टूबर और नवंबर मनाली एक्सप्लोर करने के बाद आई वाज एट होम फॉर अ मंथ एंड अ हाफ बस फिर क्या था करी पैकिंग पकड़ी बस और पहुंच गए तो एंड यहां पे आके आई एम एक्चुअली फीलिंग रियली रियली गुड बिकॉज आई एम ट्रैवलिंग सोलो आफ्टर अ लॉन्ग 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 टाइम सो इन दिस वीडियो नॉट ओनली आई एम गोइंग टू take you around tours but i'm also going to share a few tips about solo traveling that might help you plan your solo trip so let's start the video the very first tip that i am going to give you guys is about your stay always choose hostels above hotels when you are traveling solo this way you won't feel alone because हॉस्टल में आप इतने सारे अलग अलग लोगों से मिलते हो अलग अलग जगहों के लोगों से मिलते हो दैट यू नेवर फील अलोन मैं भी यहाँ पे एक हॉस्टल में रुकी हूँ विच इज़ वूपर्स हॉस्टल इन तोश एंड यहाँ पे आई हैव मेट पीपल फ्रॉम मुंबई चेन्नई हैदराबाद अमृतसर एंड जस्ट नेम द स्टेट सो द हॉस्पिटैलिटी ओवर हेयर द वॉमनेस ओवर हेयर द होमलीस ओवर हेयर एवरीथिंग इज सो 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 गुड सो या my first tip is please choose a hostel to stay when you are on a solo trip this way you would never feel alone and you will feel at home as the whoopers hostel say we call this place our home so with this tip i am going to share a few glimpses of the things that we did yesterday um i couldn't really record much as i was really really tired because mai पूरा तेरह घंटे का जर्नी करके आई थी एंड आई वॉज रियली नॉट इन द शेप टू शूट बट स्टिल आई डिड अ फ्यू थिंग्स ऑल्सो कल रात को यहाँ पे स्नोफॉल हुआ था जो कि आप अब नेक्स्ट क्लिप्स में देखने वाले हो सो यू विल सी कि जब आप हॉस्टल में रुकते हो तो आप कितना फन कर पाते हो एंड ना वाइल रोल दो क्लिप्स बहुत टेस्टी बनी है गुड वर्क निधि गुड वर्क चल भाई चल तू एक काम कर भाई तेरा बजेगा तू माल तो साफ कर इट्स स्नोइंग इन तोश एंड द होल थिंग लुक्स सो 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 ब्यूटीफुल यू आर जस्ट गोइंग टू सी दोस ग्लिम्सेस नाउ एंड यू आर गोइंग टू थैंक मी व्हेन आई केम हियर माय फिंगर्स वर क्रॉस्ड कि प्लीज 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 नो फॉल होए and finally 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 i am witnessing the first snowfall of 2021 actually my first snowfall of 2021 and it looks just so gorgeous now just go 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 and watch how everything looks सौ कि किस तरीके से वेन यू आर ट्रैवलिंग सोलो एंड यू आर स्टेइंग एट अ हॉस्टल यू गेट टू एक्सपीरियंस दिस थिंग्स हम लोगों ने मैगी बनाई हम लोगों ने स्नोफॉल एक्सपीरियंस किया एंड इन फैक्ट जो जिन जो लोग यहाँ पे कल थे जिन्होंने स्नोफॉल मेरे साथ हम सब ने एक साथ देखा उनमें से कितने लोग थे जिनका फर्स्ट स्नोफॉल एक्सपीरियंस था जो कि मुंबई और साउथ इंडिया से थे तो दिस इज़ अ थिंग अबाउट हॉस्टल्स तुम और लोगों के एक्सपीरियंसिस का पार्ट बनते हो यू गेट टू शेयर देर हैप्पीनेस with yourself and your happiness with themselves so please choose hostels whenever you are, you are traveling solo and you will never ever ever feel that you are lonely or alone so yeah ye wali tip hum yahi khatam karte hain and ab chalte hain breakfast karne ke liye because i am very hungry and let's see how the day turns out i'll be taking you around tosh and also side by side mein tips share karti rahungi so let's go this was your first snowball experience रहा है 
just got done with breakfast and now we are going to play Uno. कल रात को भी हमने इतना Uno खेला था and now again we are at it. So I'll be playing with these guys who I've met here at Whoopers. Please introduce yourself. Hi guys, I'm Ashish from Mumbai. Hi, I'm Ashuni from Mumbai. Hey, Ravi from Bangalore. Hi, Kiran from Hyderabad. Hi, Harshad from Hyderabad. <coughs> Rishi from Mumbai. Who sure. cheats a lot? <laughs> <laughs> now let's see who wins and here we go. Now we are done playing Uno and it's time for me to share the second tip which is if you are going to explore the local places take the friends that you've made at your hostel along this way you won't feel alone while you are exploring the local place that's what I'm going to do right now we are going to Tosh waterfall and I'll be showing you the friends that I've made here they are super cool super awesome and let's go So anywhere you go, mountain dogs will follow you. Yeah. They never leave you alone, yeah. So how can you be traveling solo if you have these cuties accompanying you? The views are beautiful, no doubt. Yep. Hana? Very beautiful. They are actually breathtaking again, they are taking a breath away to it. That's the main thing. Yeah, no doubt. And those are looking really cool. Yeah. Like, what you are what you're wearing is looking super cool. <laughs> So there's the fall that we are headed towards. From here, it is looking quite small. Let's see how it turns out when we get closer. They keep following you in mountains, yeah. So beautiful. So we are finally about to reach the waterfall. It's just like two minutes away from where I'm standing, and we left from Whoopers around 45 minutes or one hour ago. So yeah, we have reached here quite early and if you're coming to Tosh, you should surely visit this place since Tosh has really limited places to offer as in recreational places to offer. So you should take the full advantage of every attraction that is here and one of that is this waterfall. In fact, you can also trek to Kutla but since it snowed last night, the pathways have become really risky. They're full of black ice. so. We were advised not to go there, but it's okay. We are almost about to reach the waterfall, and I'm crazy about waterfalls, so there's nothing to lose. <laughs> saved, 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 saved. <laughs> Again, you missed it. Like you've missed it like twice. <laughs> This time too. Oh my god, coming from everywhere. Bullseye! Bullseye!
<laughs> Where's Go the catch? catch? Oh, he's slipping there. Oh man, he's not daring. Catch. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We are back from the waterfall and now we'll have some Maggie and Chai just the cafe that is situated near the waterfall itself. Okay, so the other tip that I would want to share with all the females out there who are traveling solo is that please carry a pepper spray or a pocket knife if you are traveling alone. It's nothing to get worried about but the thing is when you are carrying something like this you are in the control of a situation that you don't want to take place. If the things aren't turn away, you never want it. You can always use this and make your way out. So the pepper spray that I carry is from Bodyguard and it costs around 500 bucks. So yeah, this makes me feel confident. I always carry in my pocket, in my bag, anywhere that, so that it's easily reachable. So you can get it online or nearby, So you can get it online or a nearby chemist shop and yeah, safe traveling. Now I'll be eating Maggi because I'm shooting this Maggi is cold so I'll meet you at the next stop where I'll be sharing another tip. And that's the beautiful view with which we are having a yummy Maggi. आज भी उनो खेलेंगे बारह बजे तक उनो यार इट वाज सो फन यस्टरडे और आज सुबह भी आई लाइक दिस नो यू हैव कंटेंट So it feels like this whole day is going to go into checking in everything and the day is actually testing our stamina. Now we have to go there if you can see the, the pink, pink cafe. The there. Yeah, over there. Let me focus. Oh yes, there. So I told you guys that if you are traveling solo, you won't be solo. I met these Two guys were just about to come last night in the bus. Hi. They are from Hi. UP, yeah. Ilabad. Ilabad. And I met them on my way to Delhi. No, no, Kasol. on my way to Kasol, yeah. Kasol, Kasol, from Kasol. Delhi. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. I met these guys. So solo traveling is not bad at all. You meet so many people. <laughs> and she's amazing. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Chalo. Where are you guys headed to? Abhi, to some place down there. Okay, I'm going to Pink stuffs. Floyd. Are you yeah, in Pink Floyd right now? Yeah, I'm just going there. I just wanted to shoot this and then I'll go there. Yeah, I have almost reached Pink Floyd and if I go in there, I won't be able to talk to you guys because the music is so loud. And I just wanted to share the last few tips with you all. The, the third or maybe the fourth one would be that start with group trips. So there are ample of travel companies that take people to group trips. So over there you can book yourself as a solo person and go with a group so that you're not alone from the beginning to the end of the journey. And another tip that I would want to give you guys is start opening up yourself. I myself was an introvert. I always shied away from even placing orders. So I started myself I pushed myself to go there, go outside and place the orders, talk to customer care executives, which I was very bad at. So this is how I developed 
my comfort of speaking with people and yes you need to start speaking up start opening up with the people around you and you will eventually feel very very comfortable when you are traveling solo and maybe the last tip would be uh just keep on video calling your parents like before i was about to shoot this my mother was video calling me so yeah this is the best way that you would keep your family close when you are traveling solo and everything would feel all right so here were the few tips and if i recall any other tip or something i would just share it with you guys but abhi ke liye thodi si pet puja karte hain maggi khai thi aur wahan se phir se humne trek kiya to abhi i'll go to pink floyd and show you guys the place come on guys welcome to another day in tosh and you can just see with what amazing view i have been living here at roopers so last night i remember leaving you guys with a few tips on solo traveling while i was about to enter pink floyd about that the food was amazing thumbs up for that but the service was super super duper slow our order arrived in one and a half hours but nevertheless the food was worth the wait and now i am leaving to another cafe which is shalom cafe and yeah i've heard good things about it so let's see let's try the taste of food over there and i'll share my experience with you guys but before that i would like to share another tip regarding solo traveling and that would be please 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 trust your instinct as women we have this greatest power of intuition of good instincts so if you think that there's something wrong if you feel negatively just leave that place leave that crowd leave that group of people and make your way out because this is the way how you can avoid such situations and i always do that i trust my instincts if i'm traveling solo like i am right now i actually use this power to the fullest so i was uh traveling with a few guys you saw th those guys became my friends over here only so my instinct my intuition helped me know that that they were good people and now i'm going to cafe with them again so just please 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 trust your instincts and you will be in a good way chalo now i'll catch you at shalom cafe and yeah let's enjoy the food let's enjoy the weather and let's enjoy this amazing view tosh has to offer come on we finally reached shalom and now i'm going to place the order I am the one who decides what they eat. Show your faces guys. Show your faces. <laughs> so what what's and the best experience you had except for snowfall abhi tak? Best experience. Every place has its, has its own experiences so there's no best, best. Uh, of all the trip. It's like highlights of every place I can say. Yeah. So in Amritsar bike, bike riding Manali roads. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you loved bike riding there. It was literally ice skating there with the bikes <laughs> on top of the mountains. We have veg thukpa. So you guys try it and then share your experience since you will try it for the first time. Yeah, we need to. But first we need to know how we can eat this. <laughs> <laughs> so the with the spoon, okay. You drink the soup okay. and with the fork, take the noodles and chicken. Khao piyo. Khao piyo. Take khao <laughs> piyo, yeah. So thukpa is my favorite thing to eat in mountains. Like I'm a crazy crazy thukpa fan. Oh. If they had mirchi ka chutney na, mm -hmm. it tastes amazing. Like the yeah, better. It should be. Than this one. 
because it's my cheap bro. It's good. Good? Yeah. Now it's time and how about time. you? You're having veg thukpa? Yeah. I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> Just let me know. <laughs> like it? It's good. Good? Something nice. different you've tried. So if you if you want me to say in South Indian style, it would be like uh, eating noodles with rasam. Achha. That's the same exact thing. Oh, is it? Yeah. So I eat it like this only. Oh, directly with salt. Fried rice. After having some yum 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 food at Shalom, we are just out roaming here and there in Tosh, just going wherever the way is taking us since Tosh is literally a very tiny hamlet and there's nothing but to explore the local lifestyle. The way these people live their lives is actually commendable. The way they are accustomed to these harsh weathers and everything, it's actually really motivating. So yeah, today's day is pretty, pretty much relaxing only. We have nothing much to do. Just cafe hopping and village walks in Tosh. So while roaming around Tosh, we actually came to the very point from where we enter and exit Tosh and over here, this is all, all, all snow. It looks really beautiful. Hey, <laughs> two rocks and hose, two hands. <laughs> Just like any other human being. <laughs> Devil snowman. Devil snowman. Yeah. You've created a devil out of a cute snowman. Nice. <laughs> Sometimes it's good that you don't have really anything to explore. You can just roam around the place and give yourself some time else I am usually running from one place to another just because I want to cover everything but in Tosh things are slow and it feels good I'm wearing two different gloves because one of my gloves got wet in the stream when I was so excited to be and my phone just fell <laughs> so we have finally reached the very 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 famous Pinky Dee's cafe and let's find out if it is worth the hype let's go It is actually good. Like the best one we have found here yet. <laughs> that is magic. That is magic, no? <laughs> yeah. It's chocolate milk only. Else the hot chocolate has a base of whole chocolate. But this is good. Like helps us beat the cold. We are four people, he bought five, so 
extra. One is extra. And that is for 250 bucks. Exactly. 250 bucks and this is what we get. <laughs> so I'm finally back to Hoopers from Pinky D's cafe and I'm going to share an honest review with you guys. The view from the cafe is really nice but the food that they have to offer is this and the cost is this. So it's your choice if you want to visit that cafe or not. Personally, I wouldn't want to go there again. And with this review, this vlog comes to an end. I'm really, really grateful for the last two days as a solo traveler. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me as a solo traveler as much as I enjoyed being one. And I hope that the tips that I shared about solo traveling will be helpful for you guys in planning your next solo trip. And I'll meet you guys with another video from a very new destination and exciting destination. Till then, please like this video, share this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye-bye. I li literally shot a few glimpses or uh, glim... I am in Toj and it's very good awesome. Hi, Rishi from Mumbai. I'm Chi Mumbai. And Rishi's cheat is... Cheat is... Toj. I don't know. I don't like editing videos. I don't mind editing. I don't mind editing. <laughs>